This is Liz Feldusen, and you're watching Friends We Love. And the only thing that's promised to my heart. My name is Liz Feldusen, and this is my 120 seconds. I think one of the reasons that I've always gravitated towards both sports and education is that moment when you see the light bulb go on in someone's head. Their eyes, their smile, their laugh, whatever that might be, and they feel empowered to speak their mind, be passionate about something, laugh, tell a joke, speak up for the first time in front of their peers. The more and more that I grow as a person professionally and, and meet people, especially youth, uh, I realize that everyone just wants to fit in. They want to be accepted and, and they want to feel comfortable being themselves. So my 120 seconds has to do with helping all people find their voices and be given the permission to just be who they are, whether that's goofy, whether that's really intelligent, whether that's shy, whether that's outspoken. It's something that I think all people struggle with at some points in their life and all people need the help of others to actually have that voice and, and to feel comfortable expressing themselves. So a lot of the ways that I help or would like to help people find those voices and also I've found my own voice is through sports, most definitely sports, especially young girls, having them go out into a soccer field or a basketball court or a gym of some sort and get to know people that way and to um, learn how to struggle a little bit and then master something and get excited about it. And so I've always used sports as a way to help people find um, their voices. Looking at it from that perspective, sports is uh, such a wonderful natural way for people in general to um, find their voices and feel empowered. So this is Liz Feldusen, and that was my 120 seconds on how people can find their voices through sports. And the only thing that's promised to my heart, the only thing that's hard to embrace, only thing that makes life worth living.